morning everyone we're it's april the uh, 7th i believe uh, sunday here in the philippines we're over back over at the uh, multiple purpose building their buildings uh, get an update i've been uh, kind of sick here went to the hospital had some flesh eating or some swelled up my leg and ate a few holes and skin in my skin holes in my skin or leg arms and so forth but i'm on the men back out uh once again this is that there the multi-purpose building they're building at a cost of uh 2.9 million pesos which is about sixty thousand dollars so we'll walk around i've been out here in a couple weeks because like i just said my uh health and i've been uh, bedridden and stuck uh, struggling to walk so I'm feeling a little bit better today so past week so we'll walk around and see what the progress is here so it looks like they got both uh, sides done pillar wise looks like they've painted it white or whatever they do working on the middle beam there got the uh, roofing some of the roofing structure on I would say that's about 30, uh, 30, 35 feet high. So to the point up there would be my guesstimate. So it's a big building, 100 and some feet long, and, uh, maybe or so, maybe a little bit longer. So I don't know if they're going to resurface it or not. I imagine so. It's a little rough in spots for basketball here as you can see there so but making good progress i i think this is my third or fourth video on in this series about uh the construction here so this is very well made in my humble opinion lots of uh, rebarb and enforcement so i think they've had about maybe about eight to twelve uh guys out here every day working sunday they're all Got a little bit of a stiff breeze coming down out of the mountains here, so hopefully that doesn't make a bunch of noise here. So I never know when it's going to affect it or how much until it's too late and I've posted. So because the internet's very poor here and I struggle to do anything, much less edit and check everything double, triple, because it takes me forever to make a video and post it. And, get a Wi-Fi connection here so I'm over in the province here in Brock Tuckvijo Santo Tomas area so it's uh, quite typical for most people to have a lot of internet issues but yeah making good progress anxious to see what the roof is going to be I assume it's going to be some sort of a metal maybe a little plastic or something so uh, or maybe go over to uh, San Fernando here a little bit later and uh, they're updating their uh, Brongai Hall or same type of facility. They're not calling this Brongai Hall yet because they have another one, older one here in town that they're still using. This is uh, located if you want to check it out or come over and play basketball or do something. Looks like in three or four months it'll be complete. And so if you want to uh, shoot some hoops, uh, this is over by the uh, elementary school here in Santo Tomas. And this is uh, the health station there, this building here. And the school sets over here. We'll walk over here and show you that. So I think they said they're going to be done by October here. So, but that's that. So that's where we're at. So this sets uh, 10, 15 feet away from that uh, facility there. So give you a proximity. So here's some of the things they're making. Uh, this might be some of the roof, roofing material. It's steel. So you can kind of see the thickness there. It's kind of primered a little bit white. So, right around the corner there, about 100, 200 feet is uh, 
the elementary school, so that's where we're at, and this is the main road they're updating here where my motorcycle's parked. So I just wanted to give you a little update uh, on myself and, and the building here. So it's gonna be wonderful, big, uh, big uh, help and blessing to the brown guy here in Santa Tomas. So, uh, so I'll try to get out here in another uh, more regular now that I'm feeling better and uh, we'll update you on this progress on this. So. All right, that's all I got for you right now. Just keep this brief. If, uh, thanks to all the new subscribers. I think we're at 905. So about 95 to go to make it to the thou magic thousand. So appreciate all the old ones and the brand new ones. And it's taken me a, a little over a year and a half or so to get here so far. So. All right, that's it from Santa Tomas, uh, the new uh, multi-use building. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great uh, Sunday.